welcome back to my channel. Today is a very fun and exciting vlog because I have a Friday afternoon off and I have not had a Friday afternoon night off in probably the whole year and a half that I've been working at the bank. Um, and so I'm pretty pumped. Um, me and Brian are going down to Columbus. I have never really explored Columbus, but Brian has a little and my sister lives there. There's just some cool stuff. So that's what we're doing and I figured I would kind of vlog it for you guys. Vlog our little date day. So if you guys want to see us venture off to Columbus, then keep on watching. <laughs> Who's that? Hello. Oh. We made it to Columbus. We are at the Fox in the Snow Cafe. This is a very talked about cafe in Columbus, but I didn't know which one people go to. I don't know if it's this one or not, but I think it's, it's cute. Other. So we're going to go. It started raining though, which is so annoying because it said it was not supposed to rain today. So that's a little bit sad, but let's go. They don't believe in flavorings. Ashley's dismay. <laughs> For a girl who does not like coffee that is not highly sweetened. For like, people who want their coffee to taste like a birthday cake. This is not the place. It's not the place. <laughs> it's very aesthetically pleasing though. They make good pour overs. Y'all, Columbus is stressful. I don't know how anyone does it at all. But we are going to a plant nursery and I am so excited. Are you excited? I, uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, let's go. It looks really cute. It's called Stump, by the way, if you guys are wondering. <laughs> was literally the store of my dreams. Am I right, Brian? It was pretty cool. It was so cool. It's definitely like Instagram cool too. It's like a very cute one. And the thing about like plant nurseries, I guess, is they take like a little bit more care than your average store. Look. Cuties. This is a lot like my neon, po neon pothos, but it has like split leaves. How cute, huh? This next one is a real cutie, guys. Um, it looks like rubber, like almost like it's rubber or plastic or something. I don't know. I just thought she was cute and cool. She said I only needed to water this bad boy like once a month. And you got your water meter so you know when it's dry. They're so cute. I love them so much. I still I'm, like the snake plant, but... Yeah, I'm gonna get a snake plant eventually, but I just thought this one was a little bit more unique. I think she called it a ZZ plant. I don't know, but I'm definitely gonna be back here. It's called Stump. We are walking from Stump right down the road. It's a little sketch, but we're doing it anyways, to this vintage shop that Brian saw. Um, so yeah. Oh, hey. This, it just fits my... That chair is really sick. It's probably thousands of dollars though, so. That's why we're in here, so we could sit in thousand dollar chairs. This vintage store is really cool, but wow, it is expensive, guys. All right, guys, so we just got out of the vintage shop. Um, said it was not supposed to rain today. Y'all see that? I know you can hear it. Thunderstorms, too. So, like, walking around Columbus and having a night out in Columbus is not going as planned, but I feel like we've gone to some pretty cool places today, right? Oh yeah. So the vintage place is really cool, obviously really expensive, but Brian got a cool poster that was like a canon poster because he's a photographer. 
I I got some pins at this vintage shop. This one I got at TJ Maxx on clearance. This one I got from the vintage shop. It says follow your daydream. This one I just thought was funny. It says shit happens. Brian just said that the other day when he hit the deer, you know? Stuff happens. Thought it was funny. This cactus was just cute and girly. Brian showed me that one. And then this one was the first one I picked up because I think peaches are so cute. It is freaking hailing! Did I bring a raincoat? No. no. Because it wasn't on the freaking radar! I can't believe our luck right now. Hey Brian, what are we doing? Well, Ashley, you had a great idea of getting a tattoo together, so. We are being so spontaneous. spontaneous. Um, it's not like a matching tattoo. It's something that like, if we were to ever go around separate ways, I still would want and it's like simple and easy and you could easily cover it up too if you want. But I've always wanted a little tiny B. So I'm getting a tiny B. Like, a, I, like the letter B or like a bumblebee? Like a bumblebee. A little tiny bumblebee. Before, and then Bri Bri is going to get a little honeycomb. So, we will update you guys. I probably won't film in there because, I'm going to be honest, tattoo shops scare the crap out of me. Number one. Number two, we don't even have an appointment. This is just like a place that takes walk-in. So, like, that's even scarier to me. I literally cannot believe we are doing this right now. But, I think being spontaneous is really important, guys. I don't do it often, but Brian pushes my limits. So, that's what we're doing. And then we're going to go to this restaurant that we parked by. I don't know what it's called, but we're doing it. We're doing the dang thing, okay, guys? I've not vlogged in a couple hours, but oh my God. We did it. We literally went and we got tattoos. And what a crazy experience. I got a little bee. Ew, guys, look. Little bumblebee, 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 bumblebee. That's what mine looks like. And then little Bubba, he actually took a picture because he's smart, got little honeycombs. A little honeycomb. How crazy, guys. That's literally the most spontaneous thing I've probably ever done in my life. Some of you are probably like, really? Not even spontaneous. That's not even it is already 8.37 at night. Can't believe, Can't believe there's still daylight out, but we are gonna head home, a long journey home. Okay guys, we are back home now. It is now 10.12, way past my bedtime. I just figured I'd show you guys my tattoo without all the stuff on it. Here she be. Get it, here she be. <laughs> She's cute, look at her. Should we name her? What should we name her? Her name's Leslie. Okay. Leslie the Bee. Do they act like me? I really like Bry's. We have just been sitting here watching Dexter. It's one of our fave shows right now. Um, it's getting a little cray cray. But I'm super tired. I have to work tomorrow. So that concludes our date day. Lots of crazy stuff happened. Got a new tattoo. What? I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. Like the video because he's the cutest email on earth, okay? If you do it for anyone, do it for him. <laughs> do it for Ashley. Bye, guys. Love you. Bye. Oh, oh, oh.